when everything goes dark in your life. When those people who you thought would be there for you forever suddenly leave you. When your dreams fall apart in front of your face and anyone you come across tells you you're not going to make it when it seems like things couldn't get any worse. I need you to dig deep. I need you to find that power deep within you that won't be denied. When all hell is breaking loose in your life, you got to take a stand. You got to stand up against all the negativity that's consuming you and surrounding you. And you got to create a new reality for yourself. You've got to fight for a different outcome for you and your dreams. This is not the end. This is your new beginning. You have the power to change your story. No one and no obstacle can take that away from you. A champion isn't made when things are easy. Champions are forged through fire, through defeat, through the struggle of having to deal with the worst imaginable and not running away from it, standing up and taking it on. You don't have to always be jacked up and excited about it. Sometimes all you got to do is outlast it. You just got to keep moving forward. If you're feeling hurt, keep moving. If you're crying, keep moving. If you don't know what's going to happen, keep moving. I just need you to keep the momentum going and not sit down and feel sorry for yourself. You might not see it right now, but all this crap you're dealing with now, you're going to be glad it happened. You'll feel fortunate that it all went bad because what you're going to learn in this process is that these situations are going to make you into an unstoppable beast. You don't become a beast when all is going well. There has to be pressure. There has to be pain. There has to be darkness. No matter how bad things get, you got to keep fighting. It's about taking a stand, standing courageously, daringly and boldly against the odds. No matter how dire the situation, no matter how insurmountable the obstacles, you keep moving forward. You keep walking toward your dreams no matter what. This relentless pursuit, this unyielding drive is what separates the victors from the vanquished. When the world tells you it's over, when it seems like there's no way out, that's when you fight the hardest. That's when you prove to yourself and everyone else that you have what it takes. You show that no matter how dark it gets, you will find a way to shine. It's not about the intensity of your battles, but the strength of your response. It doesn't matter how cautious or careful you are. Life will always hit you in the face. It's going to hurt like hell, but the question is, how hard can you hit back? How hard can you fight back? How much of a fight are you willing to put up for your dreams? Cuz if you really care about it like you say you do, you don't fold at the first, second, third, or even the 22nd time. Something or someone tries to knock you down and stop you on your path to greatness. No. You keep destroying everything in your path until you get exactly what it is you want. And you stop at nothing to reach it. Whenever you feel negative, whenever you feel your life is getting tough, I want you to say, I'm responsible. I'm responsible for my life. I'm responsible for what happens. I can't change the past, so I'm not going to spend a single second worrying about what has happened. I'm going to become so busy working on my future and my goals that I don't have time to think about the past. You get so laser focused that you get very specific on what you're doing to make progress. You know exactly what you're doing on Monday, on Tuesday, on Wednesday. You know precisely how to make your situation better every day of the week. You turn your tragedy into triumph cuz that's what winners do. They don't just dream. They do. Winners take their plans, their goals, their visions and turn them into action. They're not paralyzed by fear or doubt. They're propelled by determination and drive. Winners don't fall apart. Winners don't give up. Winners don't quit. Winners execute. I've always thought of life as like this one-way street and you head down and as you do, it sort of disappears behind you. You can't go back once you started this damn journey. You can only go forward. 
So you got two choices. One, you get scared, you give up, and then you burn up. And the second one, you say, fuck it! Fuck it! Fuck it here! And you barrel through it. And when you come out on the other side, I guarantee you, you're gonna be stronger than you ever thought possible. I didn't come this far to just break down and lose now. I'm a winner, I'm going to win! I'll do whatever the hell it takes to get through this. Now if you know what you're worth, then go out and get what you're worth. But you gotta be willing to take the hits and not pointing fingers saying you ain't where you wanna be because of him or her or anybody. Cowards do that and that ain't you! You're better than that! Hold on! I don't care how long it takes you to finish school. Hold on! I don't care how long it takes you to pass that bar exam. So what you didn't pass it on the first time? You keep going. You keep studying. You keep writing. You keep singing. You keep rapping. You keep boxing. You keep fighting. You keep dribbling. You just keep on keeping on. And if you persevere, trouble don't last always. Every storm that's come, it will pass. I just need you to keep walking toward it. I don't need you thinking about it no more. You're doing too much thinking. You're analyzing too much. You're talking yourself out of it. I don't know if this going to work. I tried and it didn't work. I just need you to keep moving. I need you to make up in your mind that the only way you can lose is if you quit. And I just need you to keep going. Every one of my successes is stacked on top of failure. Failure is just another peg in the ladder for me to go higher. And some of you in this room today, you need to change your mind because some of you are thinking about giving up because you're in a season of failure. But just because you failed doesn't mean that God doesn't have a bright future in store for you. It is always too soon to quit. I can't quit. I can't stop. I can't get tired. I can't give up. I can't give in. I can't. Why? My mama counting on me. My wife is counting on me. When you ain't got nothing left in your tank, you got to think about the people in your life that you're doing this for. And then if you can think about them, you can go one more mile. You can go one more day at work. When you're doing it for somebody else, when you like that lion, if I don't grind, if we don't grind, if I don't grind, they don't eat. I wish I could tell you you tired. And go take a break. I wish I could tell you it's gonna get easier. I wish I could tell you that if you just keep going, it's gonna get lighter. The weight is gonna get lighter. I wish I could tell you that, but that's not the truth. The truth is, you gotta find something within. You gotta find something within, and that's gotta push you, and that's gotta elevate you, and that's gotta drive you, and that's gotta move you. And when you find out what your why is, when you find your why, you don't hit snooze no more. When you find your why, you find a way to make it happen. But none of this is ever going to happen if you quit. Failure gives you two choices. You stay down or you get up. Well, I'm up and I am fired up because I have figured it out. And I can stay down or I can get my ass up. And I'm in the getting up business. We all want to be a beast. But do you know what a beast is? A beast is someone who can go through hell and be grateful that their legs are working. A beast is someone who's lost everything but is grateful for the opportunity to get everything back and get even more. A beast is someone who can hit rock bottom and can say, Roger that. I'm going to harness this. Sh it is only up from here. I'm going to come back even stronger.